Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Today I want to show you my collection of variant covers by Jenny Frizen. This is going to be a shorter video because I don't have all that many uh, covers drawn by her. But I did a video with my Arjun collection, I did a video with my Adam Hughes and uh, J. Scott Campbell collection. I just had to do one for Jenny Frizen because she's such a unique artist with such an amazing style. I had to show you guys my uh, covers. So here we go. We are starting off with Thor number 9. Here we have the Phoenix variant. And uh, then with uh, a somewhat older uh, series by now, we've got X-Men Red. Here we have issue number 10 and issue number 11. I think there's a 5 issue set uh, done by uh, Jenny Frizen. I'm hoping to get uh, the other uh, 3 issues. I know one is uh, with Storm on the cover, the other is Nightcrawler, but I can't think of, uh, of the third one. Still amazing covers and just look how she's drawing Jean Grey. I mean I gushed about uh, Arjum's uh, X-Men uh, number one uh, cover, but uh, Jenny Frizen is doing an equally amazing job here. We're moving on to Indies, and uh, we're starting off with the, the Department of Truth by uh, James Tynion. And uh, first of all, it's an amazing uh, cover, but oh my god, this story i'm not gonna say i'm not gonna say anything about it actually but uh it, it mark this lady's words and uh, uh check it out because it's important that you see and the next up we have what was i don't think it is anymore but uh, it definitely was for a couple of years years the hottest comic book series and uh, still by uh, James Tynion here we have something is killing uh, the children issue number 11 and a variant cover for issue uh, 16 I love this series so much and uh, I'm kind of kicking myself because uh, I started uh, so late on it I mean, uh, this was uh, the first issue I got from uh, from the series, and uh, the first uh, ten issues are so stupidly expensive right now. If you have missed out on them, tough luck. <laughs> uh, I'm. Uh, it's uh, more annoying because uh, Jenny Friesen did uh, even more uh, variants for those first issues. And uh, now they're kind of lost. We're moving on to DC Comics with Jenny Friesen's series of uh, Catwoman variant covers. Man, what a time to be a Catwoman fan. I mean, yes, the whole Tom King Batman thing didn't work out for the, the character. But after that, we've had Joel Jones writing and drawing. Um, Catwoman. We've had Ramo V uh, writing and Mirka Andolfo drawing. We've had Sean Murphy doing a uh, two-issue uh, story. Now we've uh, most recently had Ram V again. And as a bonus, we're getting these amazing, absolutely amazing covers by uh, Jenny Frizen. One of my biggest regrets when it comes to comics, is uh, the fact that I missed on her Wonder Woman run. She had, I would say, over 70 main covers for uh, the Wonder Woman <coughs> series. And uh, by the time I got into comic books again, uh, her run almost ended and it was uh, kind of late. I do hope to catch up and uh, get as much of those covers as I can. But uh, on the flip side, I did catch 
uh, her uh, Catwoman run. And uh, thankfully, uh, it's not over. I mean, Ram V has uh, finished with uh, uh, the series. I'm missing uh, the name of the new writer. She's done some X-Men work uh, on uh, over at Marvel, but uh, I'm uh, I'm blanking on, on her name right now. But uh, as a nice surprise, it looks like Jenny Friesen uh, continues to do uh, to do the the variant covers for this series, so uh, that's always nice. And again, just look at her style, how she started off these covers with uh, Catwoman in this uh, in that uh, dark setting, a lot of dark red, and now we've got Poison Ivy with all this green. We've got Batman here amazing work such a unique artist again probably the best drawing of Serena Kyle well Adam Hughes but still one of the best drawings uh, Harley Quinn here again just uh, the colors and all this red and, and her expression pure pure perfection. And while I did miss out on the main Wonder Woman series, I managed to get these uh, two issues of Future State Wonder Woman, written and drawn by uh, Joel Jones, with variant covers by Jenny Friesen. Is there something more perfect than a series with Joel Jones' interiors and Jenny Friesen's uh, covers. I don't know what is. So that will do for my Jenny Friesen variant covers, but I do have a bonus here. Speaking of the new Wonder Woman, Wonder Girl now, Yara Flor, here uh, are some issues of her now cancelled miniseries. We've got issue number one, issue number two, the third issue and issue number four. I do need to get uh, the uh, the last three issues. I do have them pulled, but uh, I need to get them. Uh, such a shame that uh, DC uh, canceled this. I hope they're gonna do a... Well, we're canceling it so that we can uh, relaunch it because it's uh, a really nice character and uh, I hope they uh, they do. A lot more with it and I hope they uh, keep Joel Jones on the series. And that was my collection of Jenny Friesen variant covers. I hope you enjoyed this video. P please feel, uh, feel free to tell me which cover you liked best and uh, I'll see you all next time. Bye!